The protesters got a quiet and friendly reception at Lincoln University on Wednesday evening. It's a marked difference from their experiences in Rosebud earlier in the day. Very racial, very much. A lot of hate, a lot of anger that we were here. Crowds shouted obscenities and held signs all along the route. I, I did not expect that. I mean, it was so quiet when we were walking in. You know how quiet it was? And then just boom. After going through Rosebud, marchers discovered something broke the back window on their bus. Federal authorities have been notified. We don't know when it happened, but, uh, but you know what, that's typical. You know, I wouldn't be surprised. I knew there was a lot of racial issues in, you know, in the world. So with the situation that happened in Rosebud, I wasn't surprised. I've been taught to know how to deal with people like that. Her technique is... I ignore them and keep moving forward. Cheyenne says the march has been a tremendous learning experience for her. I learned a lot. I would say, like, I've followed in my grandparents' footsteps of what they had to do deal with, and I think it's a really great changing movement. In Jefferson City, Garrett Bergquist, KRCG 13 News.